longevity medicine, which is uh, really the next step. It's not just a matter of fixing a problem like traditional medicine does when it arises. It's more than just uh, functional medicine. It's actually looking further afield and seeing what treatments, what options, what lifestyle interventions, what hormones can get involved now to ward off signs of aging later. Is, is, is that is that right, Mo? Yes, I would say that when it comes to longevity, there are obviously countless different ways when I can approach this from. What I think, what's very neglected is the vitality component. By vitality, I do not mean cellular mechanisms of autophagy, of aging, of degeneration, but rather how vital is a person because a lot of our longevity is connected to lifestyle and behavioral choices. So simply, purely from a perspective of how do I behave, it makes a lot of sense to make people feel good, which means basically increase energy, mood and motivation. And I would say that this is a very neglected area.